All right, meteorologist Nicole Hartford back with us. More on this Arctic blast. Nicole, one of the major concerns here is ice forming overnight. Yes, and not necessarily because we'll see snow or we'll see freezing rain, but because the rain that we're seeing right now won't have time to dry off roads before temperatures drop down to below freezing. The incoming cold front is closing in. It is actually about to move into far northwest Georgia. You can see the line where the cold front is because that's where our rain transitions into snow. Notice some drier air though. The absence of any moisture off towards the west of us, this drier air will be moving in, which means we only have a small window where our temperatures would be cold enough to perhaps transition some of this rainfall into a wintry mix or a snow. Right now we're seeing scattered showers. These are producing some moderate rain up into portions of Floyd County and as temperatures start to drop, this is where I think we could more likely start to see some of those freezing rain or snow showers within the next hour or two as that cold front moves in. This is by midnight. Radar looks about the same, but we start to see some of that snow formation up into far northwest Georgia and that'll spread eastward by about two or three o'clock in the morning. Now in Atlanta, we may miss out on that chance for any snowfall completely. Our temperatures won't fall down to below freezing likely until three or four o'clock in the morning. And by that time, most of the moisture will be on its way out. We'll be dry by the time you wake up tomorrow morning, at least nothing falling from the sky, but our roads could still be wet and with temperatures right around freezing, you will need to be cautious and aware that there could be some black ice patches. As far as snow accumulation, maybe some minor amounts up to a dusting to an inch for some of far north Georgia. Consider yourself lucky if you get a couple flurries in Atlanta. Our temperatures will be rapidly dropping. It's going to start soon for far Northwest Georgia by two o'clock in the morning. We're below freezing there in Atlanta. We're still around 41 degrees. The cold front is just starting to move through. Look at temperatures by the time you're waking up tomorrow morning, though, feels like temperatures will be below zero for the morning hours. And by the afternoon, we'll still see feels like temperatures in the single digits and even below zero. Because of that, we do have wind chill watches and warnings as well as wind chill advisories that are in effect. This essentially just warns that this is a dangerous cold, so you need to be cautious if you do plan to be outdoors, that you're dressed and layered properly. And if you can avoid being outdoors in this uh, dangerous cold air, then that is definitely preferable. The coldest temperatures are on Saturday morning. It's going to be gusty, very windy into tonight as well as tomorrow. And then those winds will steadily start to die down as we kind of climb out of this Arctic air. By Sunday afternoon, some of us will get above freezing. Many will have to wait until Monday, though, and it's a gradual climb back up to temperatures overnight above freezing by Thursday.